we will show them our sign to the universe and in their own selves until it becomes manifest to them that this, the Quran, is the truth. Chapter 41, Husayl, verse 53. Based on the Quranic verse, Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala, exhorts Muslims to observe and study the universe in order to find some of his signs. For that reason, many verses of the Noble Quran invite Muslims to study nature and seek knowledge, and this has been interpreted to mean encouragement for scientific inquiry. Today, you will know that Quran is the most reliable book. Here we will tell you 10 scientific facts which are already present in Quran but are proved today. Number 10, Origin of Life, the Water. In Surah in Abaya, it was revealed we made every living thing from water. Will they not believe? Quran chapter 21, verse 30. And it was only after the discovery of the microscope that it was concluded that all living things consist mostly of water. While in the deserts of Arabia, the last thing a man could guess is that all of life ultimately came from water. People live in Arab are shocked that their life is bound to water. Number 9. Iron, the metal on earth. We sent down iron with its great inherent strength and its many benefits for humankind. Quran chapter 57, verse 25. According to M. E. Walrath, iron is not natural to the earth. Scientists state that billions of years ago, the earth was struck by meteorites. It was within these meteorites that iron was present and due to explosion on earth, we now have iron available to us. The Quran, as stated above, has already enlightened us by this fact by stating, we sit down iron with its great inherent strength. Number 8. Sky, the protective layer. And we made the sky a protected ceiling, but they, from its sides, are turning away. Or in chapter 21, verse 32. It's a scientific fact that the sky, with all of its gases, protects the earth and life that is present on it from the harmful rays of the sun. If there was no protective layer, life on earth would cease to exist as the temperature on Earth would be freezing at negative 270.556 degrees Celsius, the same as the temperature in space. Number 7. The Mountains Have we not made the Earth a resting place and the mountains as stakes? Or in chapter 78, verse 6 and 7, in a book by geophysicist Frank Press called Earth, 1986, he explains how the mountains are like stakes are buried deep within the Earth's surface. Mount Everest, which has a height of approximately 9 kilometers above sea level, has a root deeper than 125 kilometers, thus only reinforcing the cornic revelation of the importance and strength of mountains on Earth. Number 6. Expansion of the Universe Fourteen years ago, when there was no telescope and the heaven, we constructed the strength, and indeed, we are its expander. Born chapter 51, verse 47. According to the prominent physicist Stephen Hawking in his book A Brief History of Time, the discovery that the universe is expanding was one of the great intellectual revolutions of the 20th century. Although centuries before, the Quran had already revealed to us that in regards to the universe, we are its expander. Number 5. Rotation of Sun In 1512, a scientist realized that the fact that other planets are not rotating, only Sun is rotating. But after some time, another scientist proved that the Sun is not rotating. Planets are rotating around the Sun. And it is he who created the night and the day and the sun and the moon. All heavenly bodies in the orbit are swimming. Or in chapter 21, verse 33. Although it was only a widespread belief in the 20th century amongst the astronomers, today it is a well-established fact that the sun, the moon, and all the other bodies in the universe are moving in an orbit and constantly moving, not stationary as commonly thought before. Number 4. The Oceans or they are like darkness within an unfathomable sea which is covered by waves, upon which are waves, over which are clouds darkness, some of them upon others. When one puts out his hand therein, he can hardly see it. And he to whom Allah has not granted light for him there is no light. Quran chapter 24 verse 40. Incredibly, oceanographers have stated that unlike the belief that waves only occur on the surface, there are waves that take place internally in the oceans, below the surface of the water, invisible to the human eye. These can only be detected through special equipment. Corn is not only incredible because it talks about the waves under surface, but it is incredible because it also talks about the depths of oceans. Number 3. Lying in Movements Prophet Muhammad, peace upon him, Allah, revealed a verse to warn him. Allah says, Know indeed 
If he does not stop, we will seize him by the forehead, his lying, sinful forehead. Quran chapter 96, verse 15 and 16. According to a book titled Essentials of Anatomy and Physiology, it is clearly stated that the forehead or frontal area of the brain is responsible for motivation and the foresight to plan and initiate movements. All this takes place in the prefrontal area of the brain. The part of the brain that is responsible for movement and planning is said to be seized if it does not stop. Other studies have proved that it is this prefrontal region that is responsible for the function of lying. Number two, pain, the sense of feeling. For a long time, it was thought that the sense of feeling and pain was dependent on the brain. However, it has been discovered that there are pain receptors present in the skin. We shall send those who reject our revelations to the hellfire. When their skins have been burned away, we shall replace them with new ones so that they may continue to feel the pain. God is almighty, all wise. Or in chapter 4, verse 56, without these pain receptors, a person would not be able to feel pain. Another example of the scientific miracles of the Holy Quran. And lastly, on to number one, the Big Bang Theory. And those who disbelieved not considered that the heavens and the earth were a joined entity, and we separated them. For in chapter 21, verse 30, in 1929, American astronomer Edwin Hubble proposed the Hubble's Law, according to which all entities in space are moving away from the earth at speeds proportional to their distance. In essence, the greater the distance from the earth, the faster they are moving. Soon after this, he discovered the galaxies are moving away from each other as well, which means that the universe is expanding overall. This laid the basis for the Big Bang Theory, which states that around 12 to 15 billion years ago, the universe came into existence from one single extremely hot and dense point. Due to an explosion of this point, the universe came into being. The universe since then has been expanding from this single point. In 1965, radio astronomers Arno Penezes and Robert Wilson won the Nobel Prize for the discovery that they confirmed the Big Bang Theory. When looking at the verse cited above while acknowledging Allah knows best, it remains astounding that the Quran had already revealed that the heavens and the earth were a joined entity and we separated them. Hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know in the comments below. Give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. See you soon.